A window repair specialist charges $220 for the first two hours of repair, plus an hourly fee for each additional hour. The total cost for five hours of repair is $400, which function F gives the total cost in dollars for X hours of repair, where X is greater than or equal to two. Okay, so for the first two hours, the window specialist charges $220, and then after those two hours, so greater than two hours, he charges some fee that we don't know yet. Okay, we can represent this by, so let's say that the total cost is equal to $220 since we will be greater than or equal to Two hundred two hours, so we will always be charged the two hundred twenty dollars, plus some hourly fee for each additional hour. We can represent that by this right here, n times x minus two, where x is the number of hours, number of hours, and x minus two, or the number of hours minus two, that it takes for a repair job, will give us the total number of hours spent on the repair job after the first two hours. Since we're subtracting two from the total number of hours, this will give us how many hours that we are being charged the hourly fee for. So n will be the hour, hourly fee, hourly fee. So we can, then we can use the information that the total cost for five hours of repair is $400 to solve for n. So the total cost was 400, so we'll substitute that in for the total cost. So 400, and that equals 220 plus n times 5 hours, since we spent 5 hours on the repair job. So x will be 5 minus 2. So then four, we can simplify this to 400 equals 220 plus 5 minus 2, which is 3, so 3n. So then then we can just solve for the value of n. 400, 4, 400 minus 220 is equal to 180. If we subtract 220 from both sides, so then we'll be left with 180 equals 3n. Then if we divide both sides by 3, we'll get that n equals 60. Okay, so now we know our hourly fee. So we can substitute that in for our original equation. So let's do that here. So we say that our total cost, we'll say that's f of x now, since that's what the problem statement wanted us to give it as. It's a function f that gives the total cost as a function of the x hours of repair. So f of x equals 220 plus 60, since n is now 60, since we solve for that here. That's the hourly fee times x minus 2. It's important that we keep the x minus 2 because the hourly fee of 60 is only charged for the hours after the first two. So x minus 2 gives us the hours after the first two. So we can just simplify this down. So 220 plus 60x minus 120. And that is just equal to, so 220 minus 120 is just equal to 100. So this is just 60x plus 100. And that is answer choice A.